Hey guys, LEGO World War 2 Reviews here, and today I'm going to be reviewing the LEGO Star Wars Clone Troopers vs. Droidicas Battle Pack. Um, this was a early 2013 set, I believe. Uh, so, there's the front of the box, of course. Recommended ages are 6 through 12. The set number is 75000, 124 pieces. So that's that. And it does have the Yoda artwork. That was the artwork for 2013. Back of the box. Other side and the bottom of the box. So I'll just set that back there. And uh, we will start with the clones first. Because I'm sure that's what everyone would get this set for. Because the build isn't that exciting and I will go over that later. Um, so first we have a clone sergeant, I believe. Um, hold on, let's just get his accessories out of his hands here. And as you can see, he has the uh, four dots on his chest that uh, indicates that he is a sergeant. And he has all sorts of green over him, which looks very nice. Uh, the olive green arms. I believe this is olive green. Back printing. So, yeah, that is uh, him. And we will get on with the other clone trooper. His accessory. Alright, here's the other clone trooper. As you can see, mine was a little bit misprinted. He, uh, his helmet, his uh, visor and everything is a little bit to the left. And, yeah. But basically he's just like uh, the other one except without the dots and all of the olive green. So yeah. And also one thing I forgot to mention was that... Sorry for the background noise. Uh, they do have this live action face here. Which is very nice. I've used it for some World War II figures. And yeah. So we'll just go on with the Vorticas. And I do not really like this Droidica design that much, and it is out of focus for some reason. There we go. Uh, as you can see, they use like the fire hoses for their arms, and see, yeah, I just do not like this design. That's just my opinion, though. But then it is a small battle pack, and they are both the same, as you can see. Now on to the little build here. Uh, I'm sorry, I don't know the actual name of this vehicle in Star Wars. But, uh, yeah. It has this little satellite thing, which I will go into detail with later. Uh, but these, you know, go down. I guess maybe those would be doors or something. It just have a bunch of dark red in it. Another one of those. And it has that same satellite piece that we've seen for a while in Lego City sets. Alright, now on to this thing, like I was saying. So what you would do is you would push, or it would, like, uh, since it's on hooks right there, you would just flip it down and then flip the satellite up and then it's a flick missile so let's see if I can I don't think this is going to... oh I did it sort of not really but uh you guys get the idea it's a flick missile they got replaced by the weird looking spring loaded shooters pretty much so that was that set. Let me know if you guys want me to review the 
uh, Corporal Alliance tank droid, and yeah. And as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And of course, I will see you guys in the next one.